Hello everybody, it's Eva from Bohemian Crafting here again. Uh, I'm coming to share with you a uh, finished project. Uh, I made tutorial about one pocket here in this, this book. Uh, it was that hide and slide pocket. So I'm going to share with you this old book, what I made. Uh, I made kind of journal photo book. Uh, part of this book it's journal and that other part it's uh, like photo folder. Uh, I used five folders, two five folders. I put them together to make uh, like <laughs> cover and uh, it can be open open three times. Here is this half. It's for photos and here is my small journal which I made for this book uh, and I came out to, with this idea when I downloaded new software to my computer and uh, I burned all my images, photographies, digitals to DVDs and when I downloaded that new software I found that my old software didn't burn all those images. I lost loads of photographies and uh, <laughs> I've been always a loving person with books so I think it's only good if we try to keep memories in books. That's why I came up with this half and half journal where you can keep photographies as well because I lost loads of photographies when my mommy was here in England and that's no good. I, I'm, I'm missing them and nobody else got them. That's horrible. So this is my book I made. Uh, it's in blue and cream colors and uh, here it's backside. I made few photo, uh, photo mats for this book and I used those beautiful vintage corners like template for photographies. Not all of those, um, not all of those photo, photo mats, they've got those corners. I just placed them on few of them. Here I've got uh, rules about marriage because I hope <laughs> that this will belong to some loving family, hopefully. <laughs> and I think it's good to know <laughs> how to deal with marriage. Here I include this beautiful kiddo <laughs> because that smile is just amazing. And here it's just small note uh, about love. This is my uh, top cover and I used beautiful papers. Uh, I'm not sure if I remember that right. Uh, I've got those, uh, it's kind of Parisian style. They are in blue and cream color and I've got them, I think I've got them from a vintage Epimera garden, but I'm not sure and unfortunately I can't find it now because I lost those images which is really bad. I will try to have a look on Vintage Epimera Garden page, but I'm not sure if I will find it. Uh, those I found on Pinterest. Here is a small, small folder I make and few Epimeras. All is coffee dyed and tea dyed. Here is large pocket. And as I said before, this can be open once and second time. Uh, here I've got, oh yeah, when I made that tutorial about sliding pocket, <laughs> I used this glossy back and I made that belly band around it. And I told you that I don't like, uh, at the first I thought that I will place that layering in different uh, <laughs> direction and I didn't like it how I made it. So I took it off <laughs> and I'm using this uh, glossy back just without that moving, moving um, system. Uh, still is it pocket here for this small triplet. It can be used for journaling or for photography. Here very small envelope and it's still pocket. Behind that it's pocket as well for this small book. I use this beautiful picture and it's holding here this belly band and also this clip it's holding it's extendable like um, accordion accordion style photo al photo al uh, photo album maybe here are pockets on this side and on that other side it's just plain without pockets here you can see that beautiful paper I used so this is this page and it's holding on the top it's holding with this strip of paper and on the bottom it's magnetic like this and here I've got that paper clip here is it 
it's paper clip here and it's open like this and here I've got here we've got uh, some ephemeras and this uh, photomat and here you can see another paper from this beautiful collection here is another photomat I made for this journal and it have another opening here and here so here are another section of this uh, journal it's kind of um, in uh, marriage stuff um, maybe it can be used like wedding journal i'm not sure because i use beautiful images about wedding about love so maybe it can be used for wedding uh, here another photomat and here i used tea bag uh, and i used on that tea bag uh, i think you call it them ribbon ribbon it's on that acetate and you have to scratch it down on some surface so i use them on my uh, tea bags and i like how it, uh, how it looks it's a really great embellishment here just this ephemera and i used small those dies like uh, embellishment and it's open like this here is like photomat and behind that it's another photomat it's like Get here, here a small ephemera and another beautiful photomat it's in this pocket and it's pocket here, here are four pockets for small tags they are all same, are here and here is another tea bag which time we've got, oh this is horrible that time here is another tea bag and here you can see how I decorate it. Here is that uh, layering I used on that <laughs> item pocket. When I didn't like it, I just move it here and I made a little bit different decoration. <laughs> but still I use it. So here is another beautiful paper from this collection. I believe it's from uh, Vintage Epemra Garden. Unfortunately, I lost it. I will have to have a look again. Here another photomat with some images and it's it's like pocket those and this is also like small book booklet oops and I think for that journaling section probably I will have to do another video because it's going too fast oops so here we've got small journaling section of this book uh, I made this small booklet and I used this uh, this was uh, rice paper and it's using for decoupage so I use it here uh, this is glossy bag it's like my first pocket and I use this beautiful image from napkins to decorate this postcard and behind that glossy bag it's another pocket and I put there those ephemeras and I use those wooden pieces Okay, here is my small file, file folder. This is a wooden button. I uh, stitch it on this beautiful lace and I use those wooden pieces like decoration. And it's another file folder and I use there those images, those ephemeras. And it looks like this. <coughs> And here is my first stitching, that uh, machine stitching. <laughs> it was so fun. I'm still... Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. Just leave me. <laughs> uh, here is another ephemera. I use it like my pocket. Those. Uh, this legitimation and some... Uh, I think it's clock card. And holding all this file folder with this small clip and this is the journaling section and I use those Parisian style papers in all this section everything it's coffee dyed those are I think freebies from uh, Pinterest I believe here is another photo mat or journaling mat and it looks like this uh, here this beautiful girl and I made uh, out of book page I made this uh, envelope and I decorated with this beautiful image 
from Pinterest to this postcard with lady. So it's another pocket here. And this is very simple journal. Because I thought I've got loads of stuff in that uh, photography section. So I wanted to leave this one as much simple as possible to get space for some stories, uh, some notes here. Another ephemera. This is made like uh, that um, cabinet card. Here another ephemera. And here that other half of this pocket. It's my first signature. Oops. Come on. Here another ephemera. Also cabinet card. And here is second signature. It's very simple as well. Here's beautiful uh, cabinet card. This beautiful Parisian style image. I really like that blue. It's it's look it looks nice. <coughs> here I made a pocket out of this ephemera and I included this image. It's like postcard and this mini folder I made. So it's in this pocket. It's a really very simple journal this one. Here is lots of space for journaling, for tags, for anything you want. Here another uh, maybe photo map or journaling spot. And again holding with small paper clip. Oops, I forgot from this side I've got <laughs> this ephemera. And this is end of my second signature. And here you can see that uh, hidden slide pocket I showed you before in that tutorial. Here is small pocket behind. And with small ephemera, with small booklet. Not ephemera, with small booklet. And it's hide now. It's covered with this uh, embellishment. Here I include few photography, this ephemera. This way I think it's some ticket for some <laughs> much. <laughs> and here I've got small triple triple booklet or um, photomat again. And here I made uh, oh I think I forgot to show you another pocket. <laughs> I forgot some one section from those uh, photography section. Here I made small uh, it's like file folder uh, that shape. I hope I am in view. Am I? I'm not too much. Oops, sorry. That um, shape or how to make this uh, I took from Michelle Mooney channel. She's like paper addiction. She's got amazing tutorial how you can make uh, a book out of file folder. So I've been watching that tutorial and I made it uh, like she said <laughs> to do it. <laughs> so I'm going to show you one more thing from this side. <laughs> sorry, I forgot. I showed you it can be open like this, like this, like this, and also like this. <laughs> I forgot to open this side. Oh my god, oh, horrible. <laughs> and here I've got small booklet as well. Here is just a uh, small ephemera. It's like leather, uh, not leather, letter. And it's holding behind this belly band. Here you can see another paper from those beautiful Parisian papers. And here is another book <laughs> I made when I've been watching this uh, tutorial by Michelle. <laughs> it's just a very simple book. Here few beautiful papers. I used some stenciling. Uh, I, I used few stencils, Tim Holtz stencils, and I made some stenciling. <laughs> oh my god. You know, sometimes when I'm taking videos, it, it's horrible. <laughs> so it's behind this belly band. So this is my... Um, photo journal book I'm not sure how you can how, how I can call it this one uh, it's decorated well with laces with beads with buttons um, I really enjoy to do this uh, and I feel really bad that I didn't make yet any book for myself because now when I lost a lot of images lots of photographies I feel horrible. I like all my technology, but you know, 
I like books more. And I'm totally surprised I didn't make any book for myself to keep my images. I have to do my, some book for myself. Uh, so this is book which I will place on eBay. Uh, because I st still can't get <laughs> to my Etsy store. I, I, I'm not sure what I made wrong there. I have to figure it out how I can open my Etsy store again. Uh, I would like to say thanks huge thanks to all of you for your amazing comments uh, i've got there many many beautiful notes and beautiful saying uh, i've got there oh my god uh, i think i wrote somewhere i have to have a look just bear with me oh yeah uh, if i'm i'm saying that right Ayla Jojo, she left comment that if we can hang out somehow <laughs> together and craft together, it was beautiful. Thank you so much. Of course, I will love to craft with all of you if it will be possible. That, you know, all those comments make me very happy. All, all your kindness, the, the, your understanding with <laughs> I'm self student and sometimes I'm, I'm saying totally I, I don't want to say crap but nonsense <laughs> and you're still okay with that it's amazing thank you so much for that and yeah uh, i know oh someone asked me where i'm from oh i think it was it was ayla yeah it was i think she asked me where i'm from i am from czech republic and i never learned uh, english language before so that's why <laughs> sometimes com confusing myself i'm learning from movies from youtube i'm listening to your uh, english i'm listening what you are saying when you are promoting your video uh, your journals or your art and i'm trying to copy that <laughs> and sometimes I'm, I'm i'm not sure if i am copying all <laughs> right way so thank you so much for all your support for all your kindness it's amazing and uh, i've got there few requests about tutorials i'm working on it uh, i'm working right now i'm preparing right now myself for tutorial for masculine cards i hope it's it's not too late uh, one of my beautiful subscribers uh, elizabeth uh, she asked me for tutorial for her grandson. I'm trying, I'm trying. I'm, I'm a little bit struggling with making cards. Uh, I, I totally uh, respect all the ladies who can make cards. Uh, I'm horrible with making cards. I, I don't understand why. Why it's so hard for me to make cards. But I'm trying. So this is my sharing for today. I really hope you like it. Thank you so much for all your amazing comments. Thank you so much, uh, ladies, for your support. I love you all. <laughs> Thank you so much and see you next time. Bye.